One woman who's been battling weight issues for years beat out hundreds of candidates in an essay contest. The prize is surgery that could change her life forever. Faust One's Briella Tomasetti has the story from Mercy Medical Center. Meet Mary Rada, a Putnam County native who has been struggling with obesity since her early 20s. But today marks a new and healthy beginning for Mary as doctors here at Mercy Medical Center perform a life-changing procedure. This tool that I'm being gifted here at Mercy Hospital as well as the New York Bariatric Group is going to be an amazing life changer. Mary is undergoing a sleeve gastrectomy, which her doctor, Sean Garber, says is actually one of the most common and safe procedures for losing weight. In fact, the surgery only takes about 30 minutes. We do it through some tiny little holes inside the belly. We take out about 70 to 80 percent of the stomach that's removed permanently, and we make the stomach into a long, thin tube like the shape of a sleeve. That's why we call it a sleeve gastrectomy. Mary, who currently weighs about 300 pounds, says despite working out on a regular basis, she just couldn't drop the weight. So after carefully researching the surgery and reaching out to the New York Bariatric Group, she entered an essay contest hosted by the Obesity Action Coalition, writing about the ups and downs of living with obesity. She got the call that she'd won the contest in October, just days after her mother passed away. Her essay struck us that she was struggling her whole life with weight issues. She didn't have any insurance coverage, couldn't afford to have the surgery on her own, and we thought that she'd be a perfect candidate for this contest. And just hours before her procedure, Mary is feeling more optimistic than ever. Not nervous at all. Very uh, confident in the surgeon, confident in the hospital, and confident in the process itself. I'm excited. Now, Dr. Garber says that people lose about 70% of their excess weight in just the first year after surgery. Meanwhile, Mary tells me she's looking forward to beginning a happier and healthier lifestyle just in time for the new year. For now, reporting in Rockville Center, Briella Tomasetti, Fios, One News.